Hi guys, welcome to my channel Optometrist Nepal. Myself, Sarosha. Today my presentation will be on the topic of binocular single vision. In this topic, we may discuss here what is binocular single vision and what are the prerequisites for binocular single vision, advantage and development of binocular single vision. Please, if you are new in my channel, please like and subscribe my channel and see my video first to last. Hello everyone, it's me Sarosh Shah. Today my presentation will be on the topic of binocular single vision. Before starting my presentation, we all must know what is single binocular single vision, development of binocular single vision, prerequisites sites for development of binocular single vision and what are the grades of the binocular single vision and what are the advantages of the binocular single vision and anomalies of binocular single vision. Yes, look, binocular single vision. What is binocular single vision? It means when an individual fixes his visual attention on an object of regard. The image is formed on the phobia of the both eyes separately, but an individual perceives a single image is called binocular single vision. Yes, I want to clear this definition. We, we all people have two eyes, yes, and two eyes contain two phobia on each eye. When we see an object, an image, that image will focus on right eyes also and left eyes of the phobia also and this phobia and this phobia contain two images and the this two image is perceived by a single image by the mental impression of the visual cortex of the occipital lobe and this is called the binocular single vision yes look this picture this is a right eye and this is a left eye. This both eye are looking in front. This is a policeman and this is a tree. And these two images are focused on right eyes of the phobia and also on the left eye of the phobia. And this image is perceived a single image, single image by the brain. This is called a binocular single vision and development of the binocular single vision yes we know binocular vision is a conditional reflex yes it is a conditional reflex it is not present since birth when a child will birth there is no any binocular single vision but it is acquired during first four months and is completed during during six year yes for first four months this is a binocular single vision is acquired and completed during six year and important milestones of the binocular single vision first one first point first one is at birth at birth there is no central fixation yes at birth babies have no central fixation so the eyes move randomly yes during birth time we all see that both have no single central fixation so that their eyes will move randomly right left up down yes there is no why because there is no central fixation yes why by first month of life first month of life central fix reflex central reflex starts developing started to developing and become established by six months yes first month to four first month there is the life fixation reflex started developing and become established after fourth month and by six month the macular estrophosis and accumulation reflex is fully developed yes after six month six month the macular macular estrophosis estrophosis means perception of depth 
and the accommodation reflex is fully developed. Accommodation means ability to see near and far object clearly. That estropsis and macular macular estropsis and accommodation reflex is fully developed. And by six year of age, visual full visual acuity six by six normal visual acuity six by six is attained and binocular single vision is well developed. Yes, after six year, seven year, the age of visual acuity is normal six by six with full full binocular single visual development. Pre required sites for development of binocular single vision. Yes, first point. First point is eyes should be straight in all position of gaze. Yes, to become a binocular single vision. To become a binocular single vision, eyes, both eyes, both eyes should be straight so that their visual axis is straight. At that condition, the binocular single vision is well developed, and eyes should be straight in all position of the gaze. Six gaze. Good visual acuity in both eyes. Yes, good visual acuity means right eye has right eye must have six by six, and also left eye also have six by six. There must be equal visual acuity at that condition. Visual acuity will be same, and there is a development, and there is a pre-requisition of binocular single vision. Proper fixation in both eyes. Yes, fixation of the both eyes should be equal. Normal retinal corresponds. Yes, normal retinal corresponds should be. Equal in both eyes, left and right, so that there is a development of the binocular single vision. Yes, and point number five: visual field of two eyes must overlap to be a large extent. Yes, when we close left eye, then visual field will be half, and when you close right eye, the visual field will be half, and after that. Open both eyes, then two eyes overlaps the large extent of the visual field. Image form on each eye must be similar size, shape, color, and intensity. Yes, image form on each eye, left as well as right, must be similar size. Yes, image should be similar size, similar shape, and similar color. Same color and intensity, so that there must be binocular single vision and normal visual pathway. Yes, normal visual pathway should be there to become a binocular single vision. Yes. Now, gates of the binocular single vision. There are three gates, and first one is simultaneous perception. Yes, simultaneous perception. It is a Power to see two dissimilar object can be superimposed to form a complete image. Yes, look. It means that there is there must be two dissimilar object, and that should be superimposed to see a single to form a complete image. This is called simultaneous perception. Look by this example. This is a prism. And this is a line, and these are two objects, and these two objects are superimposed here. Prism with line. This is a superimpose of the two objects to form a complete image. This is the simultaneous perception. Fusion. Ability of Eyes to superimpose to com to to incomplete but similar image to form one complete image. Yes, ability of eyes, both eyes, left as well as right, to superimpose to incomplete but similar image. Yes, this is a 
own rat and this is also own rat and this is are incomplete not a complete this is a incomplete and to form own complete image this is own complete image by the fusion of the both right and left eyes this is called the fusion gates of the fusion and estropsis estropsis means perception of the depth it is the ability to obtain an impression of the depth by superimposition of two pictures of the same object which have been taken from different angles yes. same object which has been taken from different angle that is superimposed by the two eyes left, left as well as right and this is the estropsis of the estropsis of the binocular single vision and what are the advantage of binocular single vision if there is a binocular single vision increase in field of vision yes if there is a binocular single vision we can see large visual field and estropsis 3d perception of image height width and length and enhance visual acuity content sensitivity binocular vision is better than uniocular vision yes binocular vision is more comfortable and more better than uniocular vision if you close one eyes there is uncomfortable to see and when we open both eye then there is a binocular single vision and this is a better than uniocular vision blind spot of each eye is overlap yes anomalies of binocular single vision first one is suppression second one is amblyopia and third one is abnormal retinal correspondence and fourth one is confusion and fifth one is diplopia thank you guys for watching my video first to last and also if you are new in my channel optometrist nepal please like and subscribe my channel and also press on bell icon to get a new video from my channel thank you thank you all of you